Hey guys, what's going on? It's Fatal Reaver today, bringing you a video. Today we are doing a video on the HP Pavilion gaming laptop once again. And today we're doing a video on how to, you can optimize it, you can make it run games better. Uh, more importantly, how, um, why I bought it as well, and why you should buy it and consider buying it. And if you are considering buying it, it's a few things you should know. So let's first get into what this, uh, before we actually start guys, be sure to like and subscribe this video, or subscribe, really appreciate it. And, uh, welcome you to the channel if you're new and looking at videos like this so there is a uh, recently a ad going around on black friday that this laptop will be down to 400 dollars. now this laptop is typically anywhere from 600 to 700 uh different variants of it and the variant this one is is a ninth gen i5 quad core processor 9300 cpu 15.6 inch display this is a 60 hertz monitor just to be uh, clear we got an 8 gigabyte ram um, you can upgrade to 16 if you prefer later on. 256 gigabyte, gigabyte SSD and a GTX 1650. And what most people don't understand about that, that is uh, NVIDIA. And you can use what something called is called GeForce Experience up here. And you can go download that. It is powered by NVIDIA. Um, it is a recording software where you can record, even live stream with it, and take screenshots and etc. So, more importantly, how do we? So, why I bought it? So, let's get into why I bought it. So, I bought this laptop mainly just to do edits with and stuff like that. Um, nothing big, nothing major. I might, I, you know, I was um, uh, wanting to play games, maybe like Minecraft, Fortnite, every now and then. Something, something small. Nothing, nothing major of like, oh my gosh, let me, let me, you know, download every game I have. Which um, I do have a external hard drive on my main PC which is why I can play all the games that you guys see. I just plug it up to there and it instantly pulls all the games over. But let's talk about how to optimize and how you can play better on this laptop and give you a better experience if you're having lag issues or et cetera with my, with my internet. Now with mo most people's internet, you're probably gonna have more than 10 megabytes a second. I am lucked out and have really bad internet. But that doesn't stop me from possibly uh, kind of helping that situation out. So if you can see right here to the left, all laptops typically have an Ethernet cord, a cable um, port. And so does my PC, which is what it runs on. And that's why I have a pretty stable connection, at least when I'm playing games, and stable uh, connection for like ping and stuff. I have nothing else running on it, and I have one said connection in here. And this is what I use, an Ethernet cord. They're inexpensive, you can get them, and most people already usually have them. So this is one thing you can do to optimize the gameplay as well as for your internet and everything like that, especially if your internet's slow or maybe your Wi-Fi is just slow. Some people's Wi-Fi connection, the Wi-Fi connection sometimes is bad, but the internet's really not that bad. So Ethernet cord is the way to go when you do that. You know, other things like that. Um, I also do have a wireless mouse with it as well that, you know, obviously you can do too. I don't really care for the mouse pad. This mouse pad's not bad. It's very responsive and works very well, but I don't really care for mouse pads. I'd rather have, you know, the mouse. Next thing we're going to go and look at, you're going to click Control Alt Delete, and you're going to go to Task Manager. And what this happens is now some games don't work. So games like Fortnite, you'll have to do extra steps. And if you want to look those up, by all means, because I've tried to do it, and I really just don't know how to do it. But for certain games like Modern Warfare, Modern Warfare and a lot of other games, I have optimized on my main uh, main PC over here. And what all you literally have to do is click Control-Delete again, you go to Task Manager, and you go to Details, find the game that's running, and then you'll click, uh, I believe it's Details, um, and then you'll just literally type in um, Set Priority. So this Set Priority... And you probably can't see that. It's probably too bright. Let me see if I can turn the brightness down here. And we'll see. Yeah, we can see it now. So you'll see this option right here that says set priority. And then you're literally just going to click set priority. Not real time. You're going to click high. And ever when you do that, your game will automatically pretty be optimized where it runs the highest capability that this laptop or PC is capable of. And it will put all of its main power into that program when it's running. So that will give you more... Um, better stability better quality in the whatever program you're running or wanting it to run and that can just be simple apps like you could you have you know photoshop um games minecraft stuff like that fortnite you know everything which fortnite is a lot more complicated than most games to do that when like modern warfare i literally just clicked right click and set priority fortnite for some reason doesn't like to let you do it and i don't know why um but you know some people have figured out how uh but you know so anyways we're gonna uh so that is pretty much on how to optimize it and why I bought it. 
Um, another thing that people don't under, uh, don't think about that I didn't either. When you're on battery, um, you're always gonna want this. You're always gonna want it plugged up. Normally, typically, you can leave it unplugged. It does have a pretty good battery life. But when you're playing really really high games, like uh, and don't worry about the battery overheating unless you have a problem. Unless you get a really bad um charger or just a bad maybe a bad laptop and you take it back and exchange it for another one um i've not had any problems with no overheating or at all and i've run temperature diagnostic tests on here that you can download um pretty simply like right here cpu um monitor and nothing got hot and that was with about an hour of gameplay of fortnite different games i just switched over within the hour so on this on the power you're gonna want to go to the battery and while it's plugged up, or it has to be, I believe it's above like 30% battery life, make sure it is always clipped to best performance. If you have it on best battery life, it's going to really lag down your games. Like, I, I played Resident Evil 4, a game that is just a single-player game, doesn't take a lot, you know, my Xbox can play it in there. And it really, it just started lagging, like it was just like pixelated and stuff, and it was because I didn't have this on, I had to have best performance on, which sometimes that can also be to your graphics so this is powered by nvidia make sure you download geforce experience and make sure you always look on here and look for the newest available um graphics drivers and always make sure you download those or you can have problems with frame drop so um that's pretty much the basis of it and that's pretty much it for this video um like i said i've not had any complaints with it other than that um, there is, will be a link down in the description if you guys want to see the laptop and see the prices. Um, you can go look at it on Amazon and I'll have a link for you guys in the description. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this. If you have any more questions, guys, be sure to leave some comments down below. Um, I'll be sure to get back to it as quickly as I possibly can. And we'll be, you know, for future videos too, if you want to see different games, play different games, test before you buy, you know, I'm, I'm happy to do that. I'm working on some now at the moment. I'm working on World at Warcraft at the moment and a few others as well. And we will be getting that. I will be getting those out as fast as I can. But again, guys, be sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video.